glass are used as stain repellents, lubricants. Your new iPhone has PFAS in it. They are pretty much in hundreds of consumer products. That's Linda Birnbaum, an adjunct professor at the University of North Carolina, Chapel Hill. You may have heard them called forever chemicals. There is no natural way that these chemicals break down. Even though these chemicals have made our lives better, they could be harming the environment, wildlife, and even our health. We need to be aware that this is a huge class of chemicals. They're everywhere. They exist in the soil, they exist in the water, and some of them exist in the air, and they migrate all over the world. On today's episode, the science of PFAS and what they're doing to our health.